so if you click your windows button and search for turn windows features on and off and there will be option for virtual machine platform and windows hypervisor platform so what i did i had these two selected when i had that problem and when i removed these two i unselected them and restarted my device and tried to install ubuntu and luckily the installation was working without the error i was facing so this might be one solution and for some people um, you might have the problem because you didn't select this virtual machine platform and hypervisor platform so if that's the case then try um, other way around so i hope it will help you if you are facing the similar issue like me and this will um, enable you to install ubuntu 